Baltimore City Circuit Court overturning the Board of Elections decision to certify the Baltimore baby bonus, finding the proposed charter amendment that would give new parents $1,000 unconstitutional. But the group behind the charter says the fight's not over yet. A Baltimore City judge striking down the Baltimore baby bonus Friday, finding the proposed charter amendment unconstitutional. The judge saying it takes away the legislative authority of the city. The baby bonus proposed by the Maryland Child Alliance would require a $1,000 payment to all new parents in Baltimore City. It's estimated it could cost the city about $7 million a year. The amendment gathered the required 10,000 signatures and was certified by the City Board of Elections. But the mayor and city council fought back, claiming the charter violated the Maryland Constitution. Opponents say there should be an income-based element. They're trying to help parents. They're trying to help children, but they haven't thought this through. There aren't enough controls in place, and there really appears to be no transparency or accountability for the program. But Nate Golden, the president of the Maryland Child Alliance, says it's designed to help all parents provide for their children. I see how that child poverty impacts our kids every single day, how it impacts their communities. And it's just such, it's so clearly an urgent issue that our legislators aren't acting on. So we felt like as educators and people who care about the children of the city, that we had to do anything we could, and that's kind of how we got here. On X, the Baltimore baby bonus is promising not to give up hope, saying the case is destined for the state Supreme Court and the law is on our side, adding they believe the decision will be overturned and this could be on the November ballot. Thanks for watching. I'm Alexa Ashwell. Here's another video to watch. Also, please take a moment and subscribe to our channel.